Remember that beautiful woman I saw you speaking to in Shandu? Carla? What about her? How odd that you never bothered to introduce me. Uh... <clears throat> Do you want to meet her? What's this? There's someone you want me to meet? Oh, my. Well, I suppose it would be rude to refuse. Are you okay? We should stop and rest. No, no, I'm fine. You shouldn't push yourself. No sign of Jurgen. I hope Elise is okay. Something has been troubling me about these booster devices. Do you remember the experiment Noctagall was conducting at Fort Gondola? Might that have been a test of the booster's capabilities? You're suggesting Roshigal already has booster technology as well. That would be a logical conclusion. That's not good. Even kids like Elise are strong if they have boosters. If both countries were to wage war with booster-equipped soldiers, it would be a catastrophe unlike any the world has ever seen. Would they really risk having such a destructive war? Noctical might. He seems convinced that he could actually win. Especially since he has the Lance of Kresnik. Oh, here you are. Isla told me you were back in town. I'm so relieved to find you safe. Thanks. Are the wyverns you promised us ready to ride yet? Yes, but there's a hitch. Now that we're on the brink of war, we can't fly the wyverns without royal permission. For that, I'll need to head to the capital, Kanbalar. Hey. Maybe we should warn the King of Ashul how ugly things will get if war breaks out. The King does seem pretty popular. Do you think maybe he'd fight alongside us? Whoa, hold on. This is a war we're talking about here, not a tavern brawl. I'd like a face-to-face -face chat with the King myself, but for a different reason. I want to ask him for the truth behind the laboratory. 
It's crucial that we meet the King of Ajul. We'll head for Kambalar right away. Uh, okay. I'll get my things together. What does Mila mean by the truth behind the laboratory? Apparently, Elise wasn't the only kid they kept at that place. Lots of other children were brought there, too. Did Zhao tell you that? If the king truly wishes to protect his people, he'll give me the answer I seek. If he gives me the wrong answer, I'll remind him of his duty. I'll make him swear to never resort to such methods again, by any means necessary. Good idea! Let's go pick the king's brain. Oh, I just remembered. All our luggage is back at the inn. Let us go fetch it. I'll catch up with you in a bit. Alvin. You did well back there. I knew I could trust you to protect Elise for us. Well, I was prepared to honor my promise. Keep the faith, O oh, hollowed spirit. Never a dull moment with that guy. Soon enough, I'll have to prepare myself too. Huh? I am strong enough to destroy the Lance of Kresnik as I am now, without the Four's power. Wait, you sure it's a good idea to destroy it with the Four Great Spirits still trapped inside? They would likely not survive. They would lose their forms and disintegrate. But I thought the four great spirits couldn't die. Eventually, new great spirits will appear to take their place. But they will be a different four, with different wills. So that means the four great spirits that you know, the ones that were always with you, they would just disappear? A spirit's personality and memories are unimportant. What matters is a spirit's existence itself. <sighs> Still. I doubt the Four will forgive me for this. You really care about all spirits, don't you? Not just the Great Four, but the lesser spirits, too. Not just spirits. Humans as well. To me, all lives, human and spirit, are equal and precious. Let's head for Kanbalar. It seems that Exodus has slipped through our fingers. There's nothing we can do about that now. They must be as desperate as we are, given their behavior. And what do you intend to do about Alvin? If we send him away, he'll only follow us. And we can't neutralize him by force without risking our own lives. Therefore, the safest solution is to keep him where we can see him. Besides, for good or for ill, that man has the power to change the circumstances of any situation. That is not a power to be dismissed lightly. Nor is the wisdom of the Lord of Spirits. 